When I had my first breakdown, I had no support. Rachel put me onto it. Said I'm capable to go for it and all that. I'm like, okay, I'll try. And they took 10 months to get put it on. I seen um, my psych doctor. Plus I seen my GP. Plus I seen the nurse. Forms and all that, heaps of forms. He filled them out for me and all that. And I answered lots of questions, heaps. It was awkward. Because I can't remember things that well and all that. And, yeah. And if I can speak it verbal, I can understand it more better than writing it down. Yeah, planning meeting, yeah. That went good. I got um, $95 for um, my travel allowance. Yeah, easy to talk over the phone. I could talk to her like, we had her on loudspeaker. So Rachel, me and this lady, I forget the name now, Sarah or something like that. They talked to me and all that and asked questions and all that. And, I agreed to them and all that, what, what do I have to do and all that, and I agreed to have your support worker with you. Next thing I got a mail, like, letter in the mail said I've been approved. I'm like, oh great. So I gave um, Rachel all the information and all that, and Bob's your uncle. I feel good, it feels real good. Because when I had my first breakdown, I had no one. I had no one until like 2012 and then this year and doing this kicked in and it started going really good. Get me out of the house instead of sitting at home stinking, thinking and all that and it's changed everything. Mum and Dad's noticed the media I've changed. I've seen a psychologist with NDINS and that's really good. I'm really happy with them. It just takes the time. Just wait your time and you'll finally get it. Now I'm planning to stay on it for as long as I can. Because, as I say to people, I'm, I'm sick, not stupid.